Preview. Good morning, Unity. It's Lynn with your Friday scriptures from the book of 2 Corinthians, chapter 7, verses 13 through 16. The joy of Titus. Therefore, we have been comforted in your comfort, and we have rejoiced exceedingly more for the joy of Titus, because his spirit has been refreshed by you all. For if anything, I have boasted to him about you. I am not ashamed. But as we spoke all things to you in truth, even so our boasting to Titus was found true, and his affections are greater for you as he remembers the obedience of all of you all, how with fear and trembling you received him. Therefore, I rejoice that I have confidence in you in everything. My observations are that um, the Corinthians were, Paul was writing to the Corinthians again, and he was affirming their repentance. He was explaining that their act of repentance was a very joyful act for Titus. He was really, really happy. And Titus was an early church leader. He um, was a companion of Paul and a very righteous and holy man. So Titus was very, very happy that the people repented. Um, my application for that is that as Patsy uh, read in yesterday's scripture, um, sometimes we do need to uh, repent and make a change. And we can just be assured that uh, God and Jesus and the Holy Spirit are thrilled, very, very happy when we do repent for our own um, wrongdoings and maybe lack of faith or not prioritizing correctly or feeling sorrow, um, maybe um, things that we do that we really feel bad about and then repent for, um, as Paul and Titus were so happy that the Corinthians repent, my application is that our, our glorious Father and um, his Holy Son and the Holy Spirit are very happy with us when we do recognize our need for repentance. So that's my application and um, I wish you a really good weekend. I'll end in a very simple prayer. Dear Lord, please give us the wisdom to see what we do that isn't in your will or your ways and help us to repent truthfully for the things that we do that we should not. Amen. Have a great week, Unity. See you next Friday.